James Green, University National Champ, probably winning arguably the toughest weight, 70 kilos. Not cutting that big weight, you and I yeah. talked, you were gonna do that 143 when we talked at NCAs. Yeah. What made you not wanna to cut to the 66 kilo weight? Uh, I mean, first I wanted to cut there because you know, I'm th just thinking ahead of time, you know, 2016, they're not offering um, 154, so I mean, you know, I might as well train if I wanna be the best in the world, I might as well train down there and wrestle down there and compete down there. But you know, I thought about it and might as well take advantage of this opportunity and uh, make a world team uh, comfortably feeling good. Uh, so basically, yeah, I just wanted to go out there and dominate and try and control uh, the 70 kilo spot on the team. So. Pretty dominating performance. I saw you did the Josh team. I said, I couldn't believe it. That guy's an athlete, similar type of athlete as you, man. You're always in control. Adam Hall, you're always in control. Yeah. Where do you get this from? Why are you so dominant now? Uh, actually, I want to say that last year was a big adjustment for me. Uh, I got comfortable wrestling in ties. My freshman year, sophomore year, I, I was used to, you know, someone tie up, I wanted to back away. And I just got more com uh, comfortable controlling position and wrestling in there. So if a guy doesn't want to tie up with me, that's better for me. But if he does, I mean, I can wrestle. So I just kind of built off that and been able to uh, change over to wrestling in ties and not wrestling from open so much. Seven, seven, third. What's that mean to you? Uh, I mean, it's just just shows me. I mean, I've been improving a little bit, but right now it's the summer wrestling, so I'm focused on uh, competing overseas, making world teams, and then when that time of year comes again, I'll be focused on that. But for right now, I'm just trying to make the world team for our seniors in July. But for that university world championship, so I mean, I've got a busy summer, and I plan on just wrestling as much as I can. So. Do you get to wrestle Jordan much? Uh, yeah. I mean, now the season's over. We're partners. We drill every day. Um, we we'll at least get one match. Every, every practice we have to get one match, I think. And then, uh, but this past week we didn't really wrestle that much. But now that uh, I can, I don't have to cut down to 45. I mean, we're partners and it's great. It's been great. We're always uh, going back and forth and battling hard. And he's just dominant and giving me different looks. I mean, even Jason Chamberlain's in our room now, and he's been, he's gotten so much better. It's just making me better and making the team better. So it's been a good, good summer. You going up, has that alleviated the weirdness between you and Chamberlain having to compete against one another? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. I mean, as a, it's tough right now. I wouldn't imagine going down there and trying to wrestle him in his uh, his area. That's where he's comfortable at. So, I mean, he's tough right now, and I'm not cutting weight, but he's gotten a lot better, and I appreciate him being at Nebraska working out with us. Are you going to be in the trials next week and to go next week to Madison to uh, check it out? No, I, I'm just going to the Fargo July. Just the Fargo trials? Yep. yep. All right, you got anything else for me, James? Uh, go Big Red. <laughs> All right, hey, thanks for the time. Congratulations yep. on the title. You're going to be one of those guys that's going to be up for that OW, and good luck. All right. <laughs>